Hi everyone, this is Ogai Azerbaijan, and uh, today we have another Sungvak Nen artist, <laughs> <laughs> finalist, Stefan Oli. Yes. Hi Stefan. Hi. How are you doing? Really amazing. That's how, that's how it is. You are just uh, coming from your rehearsal, right? Yeah. How did it went? I think it went great. Really, really great. Mm -hmm. Last night, uh, last night, yeah, not so good, but today we hit it. Mm -hmm. so. mm -hmm. Uh, and uh, Stefan, can you actually tell us who is Stefan Oli? <laughs> so I just started like singing three years ago. So I'm 27 today. So it all happened really quickly. But I'm a father and I've been just, yeah, trying to get my music career going last past yeah year or so. Mm -hmm. He's really new in the, in the music industry in Iceland. Yeah. Before this competition, basically nobody knew who Stefan Oli was mm -hmm. and am, am I correct last or oh, not sorry la, but uh, the uh, the competition on the Saturday yeah it was the first time you stepped on stage right yes it was the first time I sang on stage mm -hmm. so, yeah pretty good for a first time <laughs> yes definitely <laughs> and uh, as I understood previously uh, you started with rock songs yeah but now you changed to pop yeah I'm more into Ed Sheeran right now at the moment. Uh, I used to be Justin Bieber when I was younger. I still like the, his music, but Ed Sheeran just hits home. I, I don't know, I just feel like we have the similarities in like I want, what I want to do with, uh, with my music, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I love, love rock still, so <laughs> I'm just not singing it because it's not good for my vocals. <laughs> okay. And actually, how, di how did you decide to participate in uh, Songwek? So it's all happened because of it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you want me to explain? Yeah. yeah, yeah. So the thing is, uh, <clears throat> I wrote a song for the Sönko Captain in 2020 as well. Uh, Isolt and Helga, they were singing that song. Uh, and me and my friend uh, and co-writer Andre, we wrote this song. And I just recently saw a video of Stefan on Instagram, on, on your Instagram, mm -hmm. where he was just singing, I think it was Ed Sheeran's song as well. And I just said, God damn, this voice is incredible. Why well, have I never heard of this guy before? And basically we just wrote the song with Stefan's voice in mind. Uh, Andre called you up mm -hmm. and yeah, you just said, yeah, let's go. Am I right? Yeah, yeah, he called me when, I, when my, like my kid was just like uh, nine months old, I mm -hmm. think, yeah, yeah. So it happened really quickly. Mm -hmm. I was in like one week, just in surprise that I got this opportunity, but of course I said yes because I want. I'm this this age. Mm -hmm. They usually say I'm too late, but for me it's just starting. It's never too late, mm -hmm. and that's why the song just hits home to, for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if I ask uh, the meaning of the song or uh, w uh, what you want to uh, portray uh, yeah, yeah. for your uh, listeners, yeah, yeah. what's it about? It's about hope and the light the beautiful light in the darkness. So I've been in the darkness and people, like the world right now is in darkness. Mm -hmm. So it gives hope, it gives, gives light. Uh, it's just about, if you want, want it enough to get out of this darkness and mm -hmm. get into the light, you just have to want it. Mm -hmm. Because it's possible for everybody to get into the light if you just want it. Mm -hmm. And uh, are you actually planning to change anything for the final? I mean, regarding staging wise? Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna change a bit of the visuals, you know, on the screens. Uh, but overall, it's it's basically the same. We're just gonna take it up a step, you know, mm -hmm. with the lights and the visuals. But singing-wise, we're gonna do the same. It worked the last yeah. time, yeah, and yeah. it's gonna work again. Mm -hmm. So we like to sing it in Iceland because we have kids have it sung for us, and it just it's home for everybody mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. it's that's the most beautiful thing. If it if it gets to the kids, it's it's enough, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but we love our language, so that's why we chose to sing it in Icelandic. Mm -hmm. And if if you are the winner mm -hmm. of the competition, are you planning also to sing in Icelandic in Turin, or are you planning to change it to English? I think it's I think it's mandatory to sing it in the language which we are singing in the final. Yeah, yeah. So if ah, we okay. if we win, we have to sing it in Icelandic, and we're proud to do it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have to. People love different languages. It's mm -hmm. Europe is about singing in your own language and of course English. We love English. I, I usually sing in English. It's the first song I sing 
in Icelandic, in Iceland, it's funny, <laughs> but it's beautiful language, and everybody should sometimes they sing in their own language, mm -hmm. native language. Yeah, I agree. I love every language. It's it's the most beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, what will it mean for you? to win the whole competition and represent Iceland. Uh, I would be really proud that Iceland would want to choose me. I would just honor my country because I love this country. And I don't know, I, I would be shocked, yes, because it's just all so new. Mm -hmm. But I would do anything just to show what Iceland is good and what it can do to this darkness in this world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, do you have any message for your fans? Uh, never give up. Mm -hmm. Always chase your dream, dreams, no matter what. Mm -hmm. Finish what you start and then go after it. Mm -hmm. And uh, as a last thing, uh, can I ask you if you can sing a little bit of your song? Okay. Þú leiti minn í ljósi Hva lífi dapnar að halt af best Þú þráir alla til ljósi Nú er sólin reynd að sest En samt er sem þú lýsir mér Beautiful, my <laughs> guy Thank you, thank you Thank you very much uh, for this interview yeah, I hope you. you enjoyed the questions Yeah, 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 yeah. I haven't spoken English in a long time So <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm usually really, really good But it's been like It's rolling my tongue But it's been fun And I love speaking in English So it's been fun Yeah, thank you so much Thank, thank you, you.